Good evening, everybody. This is Steve Fletcher with the Trumpet for My People. Today is March 8th, 2018. And uh, I found a couple things. Uh, I was just looking around here. And I found something interesting about this uh, David Bowie song, Lazarus. You know, we're talking about Lazarus right now. We're talking about the uh, resurrection of Lazarus as a sign of the dead in Christ that will rise. And we're looking at uh, the calendar of Nisan just before Passover. Okay, and uh, I'll leave the link for you guys if you want to uh, watch this video. Very interesting, but here's some information about uh, the uh, Lazarus David Bowie song, okay? Lazarus is a song by English rock musician David Bowie. It was released on 17 December 2015 as a digital download, making it the second single from his 25th studio album, as well as Bowie's last single released before his death. On January 10th, 2016, the single received its world premiere on BBC Radio 6, Music's Steve Lamack, on the day of its release as a single. In addition to its release, on the track is used in Bowie's off-Broadway musical of the same name. The official music video directed by Johan Rank was released on January 7th, 2016, three days before Bowie's death. Okay, so let's look at this here. We got the song Lazarus. The song Lazarus, which refers to the biblical Lazarus, the whole song is about, okay, uh, this guy who's in bed. Okay, the whole the whole song is about Lazarus. Okay, the, it's just a biblical Lazarus who was raised from the dead, and uh, there's just something going on here, crazy. But okay, he this this song was released on January seventh, three days before Bowie's death. So so David Bowie died three days after this song was released. Now, let's look at our calendar, because we're looking at the sixth day of Nisan, which is 1-6, one, 1-6, six. One, six. but the song Lazarus was released on January 7th, which is 1-7, and three days later, the day of David Bowie's death was January 10th, which is 110, which is the date of the triumphal entry on the Hebrew calendar. Okay, so there are other people that have uh, have searched into the death of David Bowie and how it was an, uh, an occultic ritual. Let me see if I can find a couple links on that. But what we have here is that the song Lazarus was released on the seventh day of the first month. And he died three days later on the tenth day of the first month. Okay, the, the January 10th coincides with the date of the triumphal entry on the Hebrew calendar, the 10th day of the first month. And then we have Lazarus that was released three days earlier, and then he died. <laughs> so, I mean, there's this release of Lazarus, and three days later, <laughs> him being killed.
Okay, let's see if we can find something. Okay, here is a video I found by On Point Preparedness. This was published on January 12th, 2016, just a few days after his death. And uh, this talks about David's, David Bowie's death and occult Lazarus resurrection and how this was the last piece that was left uh, for the world before his death that was coming. And he only died three days after this, uh, this, this song was released. Okay, so there's, there's uh, the coincidence of him dying three days after this was released. And it also lines up with the date on the calendar, the seventh day of the first month and the tenth day of the first month. And uh, this is what we have been watching Okay, so I'll just uh, leave this with you here now, and uh, I'll leave the links to those three. Uh, I have three links I will share with you, and if you want to uh, look into this more, you can, okay? All right, guys, have a great night. God bless.